So you guys, I'm doing a little bit of a different video today. I am going to be starting school uh, in a couple of hours time. I'm going for a, a pre-orientation uh, talk and they're just going to settle like some school administrative uh, things for me. Uh, and I'm going to be attending the session to you know, get to know about like my university culture and things like that. So I decided to start packing my bag. Uh, a bit early in advance because school officially starts uh, after the coming week so yeah I thought I'll just bring you guys along and share with you guys about some of the concerns I have about school as well so yeah uh, please do not mind the uh, messy the huge mess behind I'm just gonna be packing my school bag uh, I use an MSI laptop over here uh, so I'm going to be bringing this to school and uh, when I bought my MSI laptop, uh, they also gave me a free bag as well. So yeah, I'm going to unzip the bag and let me just show you guys. Uh, so just a, a water bottle, nothing crazy. Uh, I've got some stationery inside. Uh, let me just show you guys. Let me just get my camera focus. Yeah, so nothing crazy, just all the, the pens in like different colors. The scissors because you really never know what you need to cut. Uh, ruler, correction tape, stapler, uh, some staple bullets, and I don't know why I put a glue stick, but hey, so I do that. And got a highlighter and a clip just in case I need to clip stuff together. A pencil, and yeah, hopefully to write things on. Uh, I brought a notebook. I just bought one notebook first. I'm not sure how many notebooks I'll be needing, but I'll just bring one just in case. Uh, I might need more. I have an umbrella so this is just for you know in case it rains uh i live in singapore so it can rain quite often uh yeah these are just some a document for my school that i'll be using for administrative purposes so yeah i'm just gonna zip up back over here just have like a couple of like there's a mask box just in case I need to wear masks even though it's not compulsory to wear that anymore. Uh just I've got some wet tissues and a couple of tissue papers and yeah that's uh, that's pretty much it for my bag. Oh wait, I got a few more things. So I decided that I'm gonna bring a two portable chargers uh to school and of course uh, that means I'm gonna have some bring the wires and uh, I'll just bring this cable I'll just bring the cable uh, along the power plug with me just in case I may need it uh, currently uh, if you're wondering what laptop I'm using I'm using a uh, MSI Cyborg 15A13V uh, I upgraded it to have one terabyte of space uh, I'm not gonna bring my headphones to school um, I'm just gonna bring like a uh, my wireless earpiece for so those who are wondering. Uh, honestly, I don't know which Sennheisers these are, but they were like the cheapest. They costed like, me like about eighty bucks. Uh, I usually use this for home. These are my earpiece. These are the Sony Link Buds S, or is it just Link Buds? I'm not sure, but yeah, I usually just bring this everywhere I go. And of course, I uh, can't forget to smell good. I This is my antiperspirant slash deodorant from Degree. And this is my uh, everyday cologne, the Aqua Di Gio Profondo from Armani. So yeah, I've already packed up uh, most of the things. And right now I'm just waiting for school to start. It's about three and a half days of like orientation-ish. That's about like, yeah, it's about there. And honestly, I am pretty nervous about how school will turn out for me. Uh, I'm pretty worried as well about how the you know future in school will be like for me. I'm not a very human kind of person. I don't know if that really makes sense, but like I'm just not great when it comes to like you know being around people, right? I don't have any like negative feelings towards like people around me. I'm just like not very good at like social interaction uh, I'm not I don't really know how to read like body language and like social cues super well so I worry that I fall short of like being um, like a person that is you know someone who is like sociable 
with people around me. I'm also not someone who's like gifted in uh, academics. So I don't know, it might be hard for me to 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 excel while in school. I don't think like that's the main issue that I have with, with school, you know, in terms of like excelling. Well, I don't I don't plan to to get like a perfect GPA uh, when I go to school. I just hope that the workload for school is manageable and that I will be able to get by, you know, be it doing assignments, group projects and examinations. Gosh, I hate examinations uh, so much, but at the same time, it's also really stressful to do a lot of assignments. So I don't know, I guess it's good to have balance, but at the same time, I just, I just don't like the, the pressure that exams give someone. I know this video might sound a bit long-winded and a bit whiny from my side, but I just want to share with you guys that, you know, like, I'm pretty nervous for for school. In fact, before before I came into university uh, three years ago, I was studying in a polytechnic. So basically, in Singapore, uh, you go to polytechnic after uh, secondary school. Uh, you can go to either Polytechnic or Junior College uh, to get either your A-levels or your diploma. So I went to Polytechnic to get my uh, diploma uh, for three years. Uh, it's basically like a small university, if I can like put it that way. Honestly, I did have fun. Uh, I wouldn't say that the experience was was like bad, but I didn't enjoy the studying part. I think the times where I remember most fondly of was you know when I got to hang out with friends you know uh, get to bond with my my group mates you know get a chit chat uh, over things that weren't really like school related you know and I guess the only school related stuff that I do remember were the traumatic times I had when I had to you know study for examinations realize that I was missing out uh, certain points in my notes like a day before the exam trying to cram as much knowledge as I can in, into my head and Man, it was just a real struggle But at the same time, you know it it made you know memorable memories. So I, I guess Maybe I could you know make similar memories like that in in university But you know at the end of the day, I wouldn't know how things would turn out until I start uh, my new journey at university so I'm just gonna take it you know day by day I'm not going to overthink not overthink but I try not to overthink and you know worry myself too much I'll just take it one step at a time and see how things go I guess one of the ways to actually have you know good energy uh, and feel good about going to school for my orientation is to have a good night's sleep and uh, unfortunately it is 12.40 at the moment so probably get about 7 hours of sleep which is honestly not too bad and yeah probably going, I'll probably be heading to sleep now and yeah I'll see you guys pretty soon